exists because we allow it. And you will end because we demand it. Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. And welcome back to more of Mass Effect. This is Hill here with Commander Sindarius Shepard, Erdnot Rex, and Garrus Vicarian. We're here on Vermeyer, storming Saren's base to see if we can't find out what he's up to. All right, let's go. All right, let's just toss out a singularity. here before it's too late everyone in this place is trying to kill me do I look like a soldier I'm a neuro specialist and this job isn't worth dying over or worse you think the indoctrination only affects prisoners sooner or later Saren will want to dissect my brain too I thought this was a breeding facility not this level we're studying sovereign's effect on organic minds at least that's what I assumed Saren kept us in the dark as much as possible you helped him, and you didn't even know why? I didn't have the option of negotiating. This position is a little more permanent than I had expected. But I can help you. This elevator behind me goes to Saren's private lab. I can get you in. See? Full access. All of Saren's private files. Are we good? Can I go? What were you studying here? It's that ship, Sovereign. It emits some kind of signal. Undetectable, but it's there. I've seen the effects. Saren uses it to influence his followers. To control them. It's called indoctrination. Direct exposure to the signal turns you into a mindless slave, like the Solarian test subjects. But there's collateral damage, too. What do you mean by collateral damage? Sovereign's signal is too strong. Spend too much time near the ship and you feel it, like a tingle at the back of the skull. It's like a whisper you can't quite hear. You're compelled to do things, but you don't know why. You just obey. Eventually, you just stop thinking for yourself. It happens to everyone at the facility. My first test subject was the man I replaced. Now I just want to get out of here before it happens to me. Why is Saren researching this? Isn't he the one controlling it? The signal comes from the ship. It makes us obey Saren, but I don't think he controls it. Not exactly. I think... he's scared it might be affecting him. Indoctrination is subtle. By the time the effects become noticeable, it's usually too late. Hmm. Tell me more about this signal. Signal's not exactly the right word. There is some kind of energy field emanating from the ship. It changes thought patterns. Over time, days, maybe a week, it weakens your will. You become easier to manipulate and control, but it's a degenerative condition. There's a balance between control and usefulness. The less freedom a subject maintains, the less capable it becomes. You conducted brutal experiments on helpless test subjects. You helped Saren. You don't get to live. I just did what I was told. I didn't have a choice. I'm sorry. Sorry doesn't help your victims. No! No! Oh! Sorry. Wow. Oh, nine renegade points for that. Man, this dude is so vicious. All right, average decryption. Let's see if we can't do this. Yes, got it. All right, we are going to omni gel all this. Saren's private lab. Finally, 
as Shepard faced in the right direction. Okay. Commander, look over here. It's another beacon. Like the one on Eden Prime. Really? Oh boy. All right. Here we go. Isn't anybody going to ask if Shepard is okay? Wow, you, I took a heartless group with me. Thanks a lot for, for you know, checking on me. All right, come on, let's go. <gasps> what? I get the feeling something bad is about to happen. You are not Saren. What is that? Some kind of VI interface? Rudimentary creatures of blood and flesh. You touch my mind, fumbling in ignorance, incapable of understanding. I don't think this is a VI. There is a realm of existence so far beyond your own, you cannot even imagine it. I am beyond your comprehension. I am Sovereign. Sovereign isn't just some Reaper ship Saren found. It's an actual Reaper. Reaper? Created by the Protheans to give voice to their destruction. In the end, what they chose to call us is irrelevant. We simply are. The Protheans vanished 50,000 years ago. You couldn't have been there. It's impossible. Organic life is nothing but a genetic mutation. An accident. Your lives are measured in years and decades. You wither and die. We are eternal, the pinnacle of evolution and existence. Before us, you are nothing. Your extinction is inevitable. We are the end of everything. Whatever your plan is, it's going to fail. I'll make sure of that. Confidence born of ignorance. The cycle cannot be broken. Cycle? What cycle? The pattern has repeated itself more times than you can fathom. Organic civilizations rise, evolve, advance, and at the apex of their glory, they are extinguished. The Protheans were not the first. They did not create the Citadel. They did not forge the mass relays. They merely found them, the legacy of my kind. Why would you construct the mass relays, then leave them for someone else to find? Your civilization is based on the technology of the mass relays. Our technology. By using it, your society develops along the paths we desire. We impose order on the chaos of organic evolution. You exist because we allow it. And you will end because we demand it. They're harvesting us. They're here to wipe us out. Where are the rest of the Reapers? Are you the last of your kind? We are Legion. The time of our return is coming. Our numbers will darken the sky of every world. You cannot escape your doom. Where did you come from? Who built you? We have no beginning. We have no end. We are infinite. Millions of years after your civilization has been eradicated and forgotten, we will endure. What do you want from us? Slaves? Resources? 
My kind transcends your very understanding. We are each a nation, independent, free of all weakness. You cannot even grasp the nature of our existence. You're not even alive. Not really. You're just a machine. And machines can be broken. Your words are as empty as your future. I am the vanguard of your destruction. This exchange is over. Okay, Commander, then. we got trouble. Lay it on me, Joker. I love bad news. That ship's sovereign? It's moving. I don't know what you did down there, but that thing just pulled a turn that would shear any of our ships in half. It's coming your way, and it's coming hard. You need to wrap things up in there fast. This console's been disabled. Orders, Commander. We'll head for the breeding facility. Time to blow this place to hell. Right, Commander. I'll meet you there. Joke around. All right, if we can find a way out of here. I need to do a save. We haven't been able to save in the longest time. All right. Garrus, Rex, we're calling on Overload, Carnage, and Singularity. Remember there being some crates down here. Yes. All right, nothing valuable in here. Got it. Okay, nothing here that I'm going to take. Nothing here. Let's 
see. Yes, we can still save. That turret could punch some nasty holes. Hmm. All right, let's dampen, and I'm gonna throw him. Uh, oh shit! What the? Garrus, I need overload. Rex, warp. Okay. Is the Krogan still up? Where is he? I'll take sabotage. And I guess we'll weaken it with war. Got it. That's one. And now we've got more over here. Oh, here it comes. Alright, warp overload. Got that one. One more. throw is gonna or damping I don't know if any of that's gonna work and we'll try warp again all right got it all right friction mis frictionless materials and high explosive rounds Omni gel those. Let's activate the turret controls. Look out, they follow the sun. Where are they? Shock trooper, what have you got? I'll take sabotage. Warp. And I am going to use overkill. See what's in this weapons locker. Got it. Nothing that we really need at this point. Oh, and we leveled up, people. Can we really be? I think we're at level 59. Let's uh, check this out real quick here. Yep, 59. One more level to go before we reach maximum level. So, as you can see, it looks like we did it. As far as one playthrough, all the way to level 60. All right. Uh, let's continue. feel like this elevator is moving. Okay, let's go. There we go, that's better. And I'll take the Metagel to replace that one that I just used. There's the gun. Clear those gaps and get the charges set. Hopefully overload, warp, double warp. Okay, 
there, people. Get out there. Come on, Rex. Did we get them all? Okay. You guys are really, really good. All right, well. Let's go ahead and do a save here. All right, we're going to end the recording here. And in our next episode, that sh this should be the conclusion to Vermeer. So stay tuned. This is Hill, and I'm out. <laughs>